Income inequality in a middle class that feels like it's not sharing in the economy's progress. That was the central theme on the Democrats on that stage last night. Listen to Bernie Sanders. It is wrong today in a rigged economy that 57 percent of all new income is going to the top 1 percent. Here's exactly what that looks like. 58 percent of the income in the recovery going to the top 1 percent. Everyone else shares 42 percent of it. The family income, average family income, back to 1995 levels. And corporate profit fully shaking off the recession. Corporate profits, a bigger share of the American economy. Worker wages are flat. So what exactly do these Democrats want to do about it? One thing Bernie Sanders wants to do, break up the banks, tax high-frequency trading, use that money to pay for free four-year college education for everyone. What about Hillary Clinton? She is less strict about new regulation of the banks. She wants to focus on Dodd-Frank, the uh, after-crisis era reforms. She wants to strengthen those, does not want to break up the banks, but also has some policies for trying to make college a little bit more affordable. For the record, Wall Street less concerned about a President Hillary Clinton than a President Bernie Sanders. Christine Roman, CNN, New York.